Hello everyone, welcome back. Today, as usual, I'm gonna give you some more free stuff essential for your video editing, hence the name Essential Split Screen for Final Cut Pro. However, before the start of today's video, please remember to subscribe to this channel and like this video and just drop a comment to show support. And if you have any question, just ask me there as well. You might be wondering where can you get this awesome split screen effects plugin? You can just go to the description box, the link will be there, just download the file from the Google Drive and just unzip the pack if you need to and once you see this folder LC split screen you can always open it and check and you'll see nine of them you know lined up here and how do you install it just copy this folder go to go home movies motion templates and go to titles and just paste it over here restart your Final Cut Pro go to your titles tab and look for the name LC split screen and you can find it over here nine of them and all these titles are simple because you can just drag them from the titles tab and apply them simply like that and shorten the time like this and let's go to the events tab the next step is pretty important please remember to go back to the starting position of your entire title and go to the titles inspector and find drop zone and click on this drop zone and find the clip that you want for the split screen and you know you can place your play hat at the position that you want it to be for example this particular frame or and just click on this particular position and hit apply clip and once you hit play you know this clip will start exactly at the moment yeah that frame and the length the duration of the clip you know is decided upon the length of your title and next up let's go to the more difficult title interview transition there are two variations one with transition one without the one without transition you know you just go back to the previous clip like this so it's pretty simple however the one with transition is pretty difficult to use for the first timers so I'm gonna explain over here you just drag this interview transition titles over here to your timeline like this and similar to just now you have to go to your events tab and find the clip that you want for example this is the clip that I want and select this title go to drop zone click on this icon and go to this particular frame click on this frame and hit apply clip and once you hit play you know there's a secondary clip over here and it's going to zoom into this you know second clip and for the beginners you might be you know wondering how am I going to connect this clip you know with the next part of the previous video from here so for me I'm just gonna drag it over like this and you know when it ends this is the exact movement on the original clip but if I don't want it to continue from that part I can select for example this frame and cut it and just drag it over to this position and now this title functions as a transition pretty simple and pretty cool just take a little bit of effort lastly is this zoom meeting kind of a 
title is kind of difficult because you have to add in eight separate screens. It's pretty difficult to find eight separate interviewees or whichever subject that's not me. So <laughs> I've used eight other clips of mine and you know I use it on this title just to demonstrate to you. So I'm gonna just drag this Zoom meeting title like just now to the timeline like this. And once you hit play, you realize that this zooms out, you know, with this share icon and you can actually change the words, but I don't think it's necessary. And when the title ends, this thing zooms back into the main frame. And, you know, you can always disable the building and build up effect. So the entire thing just jumps out. But I think the building and build up is kind of cool. So, you know, it's good to have. And as usual, you need to find a lot of clips. So now I have all my clips over here and how to apply them is pretty simple. Same as just now, but it takes a little bit more time. You just go to the drop zone icon one by one, select the clips that you want and the exact position. For example, this is the frame that you want and click on apply and wait for a while and you know, select this title again and move on to the next one and if you can't find any you know uh, clip showing because this is at the beginning so you can go to the middle like this and this shows so yep nine of them on you know lining up on sequence and you can change the position like this the scale as well so pretty handy and you know you can choose the next clip like this and apply clip and once you hit play for the time set, I'm not gonna choose everything. Once you hit play, you know this X like a small Zoom meeting kind of a titles effect. Yep, this is pretty basic, but I think yeah, it's kind of a cool effect to have, cool title to have. And this is pretty much everything I want to show you guys and share with you regarding this plugin. If you have any further questions, just drop me a comment. And please remember to like this video, subscribe to this channel, there are more free stuff coming. And thank you very much. Bye bye.